welcome back to Sun Up Saturday. Um, Hoshik was the name of that song, correct? It's the name, and we were just getting um, a little story and background on that. So, um, the small things in life is what it's really about. It's living a life, a, a participatory life. It, it, your, your, your life is measured in how much you consciously are aware of your surroundings and, and participating in your life rather than having life happen to you. And that's what the Kerrville Folk Festival is all about, being a part of something bigger than yourself, those experiences as you're out there. Um, Ronnie Cox, of course, is already out there. He's not performing until June 2nd, but he is out on the grounds walking around and sharing stories and songs. And you can do the same, of course, with all the campfires and campgrounds. And you can play. Maybe you can even play with Ronnie Cox. Who knows? Come and say hello. I'd yeah. love to, I, I love visiting with people. So. So come and say hello. And, I'm sure that's and how you've gotten so many of your stories, is just yeah, being so open to experience and new things. And um, Thank you so much for coming on the show today. Um, just a few more things. We've got things happening this afternoon. Yep, today's a Kwaibao. full day. We start out, of course, with the yoga and um, Shabbat services, and then we go into one of, uh, one of the uh, the one of the things that supports the mission of support of songwriters for us, which is our new folk competitions. So if you come out at from noon to three, you're going to hear um, 16 wonderful new songwriters um, that have been chosen by a jury of listeners uh, performing their songs to a full audience. Uh, and six of those 32 people will be the award winners. But they all get to claim being a finalist at Kerrville. And so from noon to three, it's a fabulous concert. Underground just needs to get out there. Yeah, you do. You really, oh, it's just one of the most wonderful parts of the festival. And if you, if I could, had time to tell you about all the people on just the, even the main stage lineup that started with those two songs. They continue to come back to festival. They, they have wonderful careers. But a lot of times it started with coming to Kerrville and finding out that people love what they do and really want to hear what they have to say. Mm -hmm. And that's, that's what it's about, giving people a stage and a song and a yeah, time. So noon so. to three, come on out on Saturday and then just, just stay. Yeah, stay the whole time because uh, you'll still have like 16 days worth of fun and excitement. Um, anything, anything, of course, we've talked about the workshops happening this coming week. Um, anything else um, really specific to this week? I know we'll be talking to you again um, the very last day. They will be having a memorial service, which they do only every five years, and it falls on this year is one of the fifth years that y'all will be doing your special yes. memorial service. with an service. orchestra on closing night, uh, Sunday, June 12th, and um, Trout Fishing in America and Marsha Ball. Uh, David Amram is a, a world-class symphony orchestra conductor, and he will be there uh, with the orchestra. And um, we'll have a, a, a soloist that do songs that are charted with the orchestra. Very exciting night, very fun night. And that's all the that's that's June twelfth. So don't in between, wait till June twelfth yeah, to get out. In there, between though. now and June twelfth, you've got just a myriad of opportunities of all kinds of special things like that. And, it's and not just the concerts themselves, five five or six artists every night. And it, the diversity is 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 really. I mean, if, if if this is the kind of music you like, you it will you will get to hear it <laughs> because because every. Every style, every genre of music is, is covered. And all ages, too. You've got stuff for the kids, everything. I mean, this thing has been yes. going on for generations now. So you've, I'm sure, seen people grow up, and now they're adults, and now they're bringing their kids. And you yes. have, there's stuff for everybody to do. <laughs> kids and grandkids, yes. Uh, 40 years in the making, Kerrville Folk Festival. Thank you so much, Ronnie Cox, for coming in and being part of the program this morning. Hope to see you all. Y'all out there, I know for sure I will be out there. I'd love to go see the new folk stuff, see some of those underground artists. So um, that's going to do it for us. But actually, I've got you on air. I'm going to give some tickets away, correct? Sure. Yes. Okay. So I've got tickets. So come back. There's more Sun Up Saturday.